Hi, it's your girl, Leanne, a.k.a. Lola. Laugh off and love always. I'm your goddess guide to deep inner wisdom and deep soul transformation. That's the Buddha and the butterfly. That's the Awa and the Vidi. And that's the Holy Spirit and the magic. And welcome to this reading for Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising. We're going to do a quick and dirty new moon uh, reading for you, Leo. And we're going to use the Life Seekers Tarot. I'm super excited. I really am starting to love this deck. So... It's good for an intuitive reading. These quick and dirty should be intuitive. I like the long-term readings to, to be more structured, more traditional. I love the Celtic Cross. It really does tell you what, when, why, or why, how. But sometimes we need just a little bit of like quick, easy, dirty energy for everybody to kind of understand and to get into. So thank you, Holy Spirit, for showing up for Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising. And please let us have any messages that Leo might need to have for this new moon energy. Let Leo, Leo's message come forward so that we may really be oh, aware of what Leo needs to know. Yes. All right, so we got a spread so far. Let's take a look. Four of Wands shows up. Marriage or celebration is coming. I'm going to say that we're going to use it as a celebration in this reading. But the Four of Wands traditionally means marriage is going to happen in your in your space, in your family. No reverse. The sun shows up as well. So this lets me know, too, the celebration is happening, Leo. We are getting into the time of your space and your critical space where your birthdays are coming, Leo. So, yes, celebration is about to happen. And the sun is about to shine because Leo is the sun, right? So this is letting me know that you are moving to a higher awareness, Leo, that you're magically, spiritually leveling up in this time. Okay. Ace of Pentacles lets me know that not only are you leveling up spiritually because the sun showed up and also the four of wands, but you're leveling up financially as well. Um, money is coming to you easily and effortlessly. That's the mantra for you this time, Leo. Just keep saying money is coming to me easier or effortlessly. You are reaping what you sow, Leo. So remember, you want to, you don't want to sow any negative seeds. You want to reap only good seeds. King of Cups shows up. And this lets me know, too, that you are... I want to say that you are grounded in your emotional space. It might be... There might be some waves. There might be some ripples in your emotional space. But you are grounded in it. And you have decided that you can be in this emotional turbulence. But you're going to be grounded in it. And in the grounding of the emotional turbulence, you can find some enlightenment, some transmutation, some transformation, some elevation in that process. What do we need? Does Leo need to know? Oh, they are sticking together like stickity stick. Anything else? Let me shut one more time if you don't mind. Yes. Anything else for really? you? Sticking, stuffing, sticking, sticking, back next to things. It's too much. It's too much for a quick and dirty spirit. You know, I know you always want to talk to them, but that's a lot. Yeah, we'll take that one. All right. This came up for someone else too. This came up in my ta uh, my live tower read on youth on um, Instagram, my Monday morning ma moon magic reading. Um, collectively, this has also came up. Please don't don't pay attention to what is no longer important, and pay attention to what you actually do have. No, don't keep ruminating about the lost things. I had this. This was this way. That was this way. Don't ruminate about that. Look to the things that you do have. Have gratitude for what you do have, because when you have gratitude for what you do have, more ideas come and you can go into your lab and you can create even more good things. So don't cry over spilled milk. Stop looking at what you don't have. Look at what you do have and then utilize that to create something brand spanking new, Leo, because you can do that. That's that's the, the part of your ability to move towards this bright new light, this nice new energy and the fact that you can celebrate that you have the foundation four of pentacles is foundation you've done the foundation you can celebrate and you can move towards this light energy using this brand new deck called the signs of the times we're going to get a signs of the time card for leo wait a minute let's see what's on the bottom of the deck ah 
bottom of the deck. Look at that. Knight of Swords. Run towards your destiny. Run towards your ideas so that you can soar. You need to definitely move. This is an, a card of movement. You are charging in. You are moving in. You are going in. Go in, Leo. Go in. I don't know why, but I'm hearing ludicrous. Roll out. Roll out. That's the song I'm hearing. Me and my homies, we can top that. I don't know. So that's what I'm hearing. Roll out. Do what you need to do. Okay? Let's get you a, a sign of the times card. Okay. This is a brand new deck, so I'm like so super excited. Excited. Okay, well, dang, Leo. We just need one sign of the times card for Leo. Just one. Not seven. Just one. What does Leo need to know for this new moon energy? I'll take that one. Possibilities. Globe. The globe has come up. Possibilities 31. So funny. 31 equals four. Okay, which is foundation. You have the foundation. And you have the possibilities that you need. Okay? The globe has come forward. To me, this lets me know that you can be around the world if you choose to, Leo. But you have to accept the possibilities. You need to go into the lab and create some more things. Okay? You need to release the idea of the things you lost and had and continue to look at what you do have. The globe has come forward to let you know that. I love that for you, Leo. I love that. Love that. So thank you so much for showing up today. Again, this is Girl Leanne, a.k.a. Lola. Laugh off and love always. And your God has got deep inner wisdom and deep soul transformation. That is the Holy Spirit and the magic. And you, Leo, are the magic. Remember that you have unlimited possibilities. Just rest in the knowing of that. Be happy and be full in that. And continue to do what you do. Make sure to watch your sun, moon, rising for a full picture of what's going on for you in this new moon energy. And make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Share me with a friend. Even if it's not a leather Leo, share with anyway. So I can get some watch time so we can bust the algorithm. Thank you so much for joining me. Love you, and I'll see you soon. Bye.